guys what people are facing in nigeria now with this money change money they have changed guys <laughs> no money anywhere and if you want to like i just wanted to take money now i took six thousand naira and i was charged each one thousand naira hundred naira and the ladies doesn't even have POSA. if you check okay those Fine change. Me, I no go. Ah, uh -uh. fine change now. See how many POS people you have here. See all the POS lined up. None of them have money. They, they, they are not dispensing. They don't have money. I've been standing here since about how many people have come here to come and take money, but they can't. They can't get money to take. No cash. No cash. No cash. Nobody has cash. People are stranded. Uh huh. Uh -huh. People are stranded here. They want cash, but there is no cash. No, no. See the person there. Here. She's here. No cash. No cash. I'm now turning to the new POS lady. <laughs> I'm turning. My dear, how many places have you gone? Please, can 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 I record you? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. This is a client that wants a customer that wants to take money, but you know. Let me hear from you. Um, it's just been a really ridiculous season, mm -hmm. I can say so, because the entire week has been terrible. Now, last few days ago, I think two or three days ago, they refused to take hold money. So you have money with you, but you can't buy anything. And then I heard yesterday that it got extended, mm -hmm. but now there's no cash. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's just... It's Even now that I came here, there's no cash. So have you been going around looking for money since? I have, since? like the entire Kubwa area. Oh! And now I'm here because I think I thought I would just come here, get it, and just cross over and just you know go go to Guarimba because that's where my office is. I just came here. She's the only one here. There are about five of them. She's the only one, and the last money is what I got. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Thank you. Ah, guys, people are going through a lot. Why change money when there is no money in circulation? I don't even know what. I'm even scared. I'm going to the market now. I'm scared going to the market because I don't know how to get the money I'm going to. As maybe some people might even refuse to take transfer. And I took 5,000 Naira. The 5,000 Naira I took, I, I, I took 6,000. The 6,000 I took, each 1,000, they charged me 100 Naira. This is something they used to charge 5,000 Naira for 100 Naira. Now, each 1,000 Naira, they are charging 100 Naira. There was this lady that came here. Now, she's stranded. She's going to an office. She's stranded. She even, she's even looking for, even if it's 1,000, she will get to get to the office. She can't get. She has been walking around the whole place looking for money. I mean, if you know this, can you can't sustain this. Why do it? Look at POS points. No, nobody is there. They cannot get money. Hey, Pahala. I can go a beg. Okay, my dear. Yeah. Mm. I got me man. Never chop any this that today. If you have my own money, <laughs> sir, me. Madam, you say no new money. Walk, man. So before I touch any of my own era. Eh? Why me? I did tell you something. You not go believe me. Today is 31st. Uh, How much? 5,000. 5,000 is 800. People are here like water, fight is throwing blue. Just because of money, we not Oh my god. But if you go to collect money, how much do they give you? If you want to collect money, it's only 20,000. For POS person? No, from ATM. Okay, because they will not... Uh, dispensing under, they're not dispensing, it's only 20,000. But if it's for POS, 10,000 new money, they collect like almost one five. For them to give you... New money. For them to give you 10,000 new money, money. it's one five. So inside the bank? Inside, no, here. Yeah. Okay, POS, okay. They're not collecting money. And every little transaction you do put in the bank, they are charging you. And I have to collect before they charge you. And to collect from court money inside bank, they have to pay like 1,000. Thank you, my dear. I was surprised though. I got uh, 5,000 for 600 naira. So I was thinking it would be cheaper here. <laughs> now you tell me. Each 1,000 naira. So 10,000 naira. 
one thousand. Call me back. Ten thousand. I want five. Anybody? Two thousand. Ten thousand. It's not my business. I'm working with. I'm working for somebody. Last week, so the rules and regulations she put in her business. That's what I want. Last week, one five hundred. Understand? Then this week is one thousand. I even went. I go to a team. Ten thousand. Did you tell me that each one thousand is one hundred? That means as I want to collect ten thousand, I spent one thousand. I am here where they are selling goods for my container. I'm looking for um, people that sell what do you call those things, wood and all those kind of things. This uh, good morning. This place is day day market where they sell building materials. It's, you know, sometimes it's always good when you meet good people. I came into the market and I didn't know where to go to, but to God be the glory, I will say that. I met this young man, this handsome young man, and he took me to where um, I saw some carpenters. If you look at the back here, you see those people seated down there, they are carpenters, they are waiting for people to call them to come and walk. So he actually got one person for me. So nah. And luckily for me, he's an evil person. Well done, guys. Well done. So, so, well done. Well well That's the only thing you have to say. Um, you know, at times it's good to be... We wouldn't know who we help you in, in, in life. Exactly. So it's, I don't know how, but okay. well, from the way I see things, I wouldn't know. I just decided to, my, my, my instinct told me to like help, help her. her. I went to, uh, a lot of people, in fact, have, his friend saw me and was like, see you, she carry camera, she carry camera, they didn't want to help me, but he <laughs> just... You know, prank stars are all over the place. So, oh, you, he thought he's a prank star? Uh, yeah. Oh, no, I'm not a prank star, I'm actually looking for... We have to buy things for my building, building my office space. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank Please, you. God bless you. As you see the video, like and share. Thank I'm, you very I'm much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Oga, uh, okay. Uh, no, let's talk about the this thing now, the things we are buying. Uh, Thank you very much, guys. Let me just discuss what I'm buying here so that we know what we're taking to the, to the place. I don't want to get the... I don't want us to go there and come back. I want to just get everything here and uh, do that. His name is Ogoja. Why are they calling him? It's just Kubwa here. See, Kubwa is very close. Ah, it's So guys, I'm done buying the woods. They are packing it in the car. So from here we are going to the container house to go and um, you know continue with Oga Ogoda. <laughs> Oga Ogoda is a very nice man. He took me all round. Uh, guys, as you're seeing them packing it. So I'll keep you guys posted. So baby, I for those of you why I don't go know. Hello guys, I'm back from the market. Today has been very, very hectic. Yeah, so I was able to get some things, all the supplies that I needed. And um, yeah, tomorrow the guy will start working on the place. Guys, you know, after they will be telling us we should project Africa in a good light. But sometimes it's so frustrating. So if a whole Wodomaya will be frustrated, who am I? Who am I? The other day, Wodomaya was going to the, um, to the, Afla, to, was crossing the Aflao border. I wanted to seize his camera. <laughs> Thank my brother is sharp. He didn't let them, you know, because he wanted to you know, show the world how they were trying to, they, they wanted to pay 2000 for them to be able to pass. Guys, if you see what, whenever I pass through that place, that border, I cry. I cry, I'm like, we are one. Africa, oh my God, Africans, we are supposed to be, 
we are no longer colonized now. You guys do something. I always get traumatized. You know, if if they could frustrate Wodomaya like this, who am I? Who am I? So don't come at me at the comment section saying we should be promoting Africa in a good light. I mean, you, you would have no option sometimes. Sometimes I go around looking for what to hold on to to promote. And I will, you know, it's, it's, the hustle is real. So this morning I was going to the market. I had changed money, Nigerian currency, to a new one. But the money is not in circulation. The money is not in circulation. So we couldn't even, people were, some people, I saw some people trekking to work because Nobody, they couldn't withdraw money from the POS point. They couldn't withdraw money. The people that even follow all these politicians around are the people that I, I, I will question their characters. Not even the, the person vying for any post. It's those people that follow them around. Those people around them, politicians vying for elections. You will see people around them. They want to call one name. Uh, somebody will, from the side will be reminding them of what to say. Those are the kind of people that I even have problem with. Not the politician, the, the, the people vying for the election itself. It's those people around them. They are just doing that for what they will get. Why will you be that selfish? At least think of the future of your children. Oh my God. I don't just blame Wodomaya. He, You know, sometimes you can't help it. You can't help it, but you have to just speak out. The guy has tried a lot to promote Africa in a good light, but, oh my God, some situations won't let you. In this situation that I saw him in, I mean, he, he did, that's the best thing he could have done. Because we need that place, that border needs to be, those frustration needs to change. Oh my goodness, you guys need to go and watch that video on Wodomaya's channel. You need to go and watch and see what happened in that video. I mean, I felt so embarrassed. But anyways, this is a thing we go through all the time whenever we are passing that, that border. So people need to speak out so that they change whatever they are doing in that border. Oh my God. Guys, so tomorrow I am going to continue with the building and the my office space i'm going to be continuing tomorrow so guys i will see you guys in my next video bye bye yeah.